yeah, 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 yeah. TikTok, this up. You look fat, this up. Me love your curve, them. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you guys could see from the title in today's video, I'll be doing an updated twist out routine. My last video that I did on this went viral, <laughs> and um, I figured I haven't done any since that video, and that video was like two years ago. So I figured. Why not update you guys? Why not show you guys the length that my hair has reached since that video? Why not show you guys the new products I've been using and all of that good stuff? So as I said, I did a updated twist out routine. I style it in an updo for you guys. This is showing the versatility of this hairstyle. Um, you know, I have some left out. I don't know what you call this style, but I have some left out. Um, without further ado, let's get started in this video. Okay, as always, I'm starting off with freshly washed hair. As you guys can see, I have my hair in four sections. Um, I'm just going to spray some conditioner with oil and water in a spray bottle to gently detangle my hair. Um, I'll be doing the LOC method, which is liquid and oil and conditioner. I'm using this original extra virgin olive oil to just give it some sheen. Now I'm going to use this honey and castor oil curls from originals this is my first time using this product to be honest even though it's an updated routine this is my first time trying trying out this um product and it is close to the aunt jackie's curlala um i got the same result no flaking or any of that so as you guys could see i'm working in small sections because i want them to be very curly the twist ought to be very curly um honestly when twisting my hair i always forget which direction to go it's right over left always when twisting and sometimes when i'm just sometimes when i'm twisting i just totally forget it but yeah um as you guys could see when i'm finished twisting i use some of the custard to like twirl the ends so it don't unravel you know while i sleep or anything like that so you guys could see the section that I am working with small section not really really small but you know small sections and as you guys could see I'm just twisting like right over left regular twisting <laughs> Prior to this video, I also dyed my hair jet black because I feel like I get a more pretty and more like juicy, bouncy look when my hair is jet black. I have like a natural dark brown color and personally, I feel like the twist don't look better when my hair is black. Not saying that the color has a lot to do with it, but it's just my preference. I like jet black. So yeah. Um, so basically, I'll be twisting quite a few more of these um, small sections oiling then the custard as you guys could see um, yeah I don't really want to bore you guys so I'll just speed up the rest so you guys could just watch me twisting it's right over left as I said so you could follow that formation
Okay, so now we're at the last section. You guys know I cut the front of my hair because I had it relaxed and I just wanted to go fully natural. So I just cut it right off. So now that I'm finished with the twists, I'm going to oil my scalp. Um, the oil that I'll be using is from Naturally Chrissy. I showed it in the collective um, haul. You guys can check that out and support her. And I'm just gonna oil my scalp all over um yeah i'm just gonna oil it you know you can't forget the edges because i am working on these edges i'm working i mean they they are there them grow back but at the same time you know me have to keep them intact keep them thick keep them um thick up and you know so yeah that's what i do so after that i'm gonna apply we'll put on this bonnet from here majesty by nima i don't know if it's nima or naima correct me if i'm wrong <laughs> but yeah i'm applying this also show this in the collective haul this is a good bunny because i mean it don't work. like this could sleep on it and all of that it don't work. it could tight at the back so yeah that's what i'm doing i'm going to leave that on for a day well i'm gonna go to sleep with it and then i'm going to come back tomorrow so yeah i'll see you guys when i come back okay guys so this is the next day my hair is completely dried and as you guys can see there is absolutely no flaking whatsoever um i use the same oil that i used to do the twisties to unravel them um as you guys could see i'm just starting like unraveling them at the root and then like putting my finger through them and just bring it down to unravel that's the best explanation i could do um i'm showing you guys so you guys could follow like the visuals but explaining it kind of hard but yeah that's the motion that i use to unravel them this is what it's looking like all unraveled very juicy bouncy nice curls as i said the black will really do something for the curl them like the black dye mm -hmm. but yeah this is just what the curls are looking like just so um i'm gonna stretch them a bit you know just a front part because as i said i cut the front of my hair so i'm going to stretch them i'm using this blow dryer and the cool setting the cool warm setting because it has two functions so you could set it on cool and then you could make the cool be warm or hot i don't remember but yeah, that's the setting that i use i didn't leave it on for too long because i don't want to put too much heat on my hair so i'm using a pick to kind of like pick it out you know play with the curl in my look a bit um this is what it's looking like on its own but i decided i wanted to have it in an updo style so i use a um a head tie and i put it up in an updo and i was really digging this updo uh yeah so yeah i'm just gonna do some edges and like take out the sides some sideburns you know that look something something they forget that look oomph <laughs> But yeah guys, that's basically it for this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.
Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm